Hi everyone, welcome back to TS Talk Sport. Finally, after the international break, Premier League football is back. Um, surprisingly, Una Emery is still in charge. Um, you know, I've already done videos regarding Tottenham and Pochettino leaving and Mourinho being appointed. But you know, this this game is very important for us. You know, it's a must-win game. Um, I personally think if we don't win this game, Emery's gone, and I think. Not just I don't just think that he's gone. I think if we don't win it, he has to go. So, um, you know, both teams not in good form. Um, Southampton's usually one of them sides that can be a bogey team when we play them away from home. At home, our record against them is relatively well. But, you know, I feel it's, it's a game where, you know, if we don't win and the manager goes, I feel for Southampton, if they lose, their manager potentially goes as well. So... You know, I've heard some people making jokes, calling it El Sakiko or El Sacco, etc. Because both managers are in a, a tough place at the moment. And, you know, I, I fully agree with it. Um, Emery now, you know, the board have shown that they're backing him a little bit. He has to turn it around. And the way he, he can turn it around is by stopping this pragmatic football, going all out, you know, being on the front foot in games. We, we know... Everyone knows that defensively we're, you know, that's where some of our liabilities are. Uh, Attacking-wise, we're, we're very good and, you know, we need to hit teams on the front foot and, and move like that. So, I feel that's what we need to do for this game. I, I can't lie, I'm not, not confident at all. Um, but, you know, I back the team. I think overall we'll, we'll, we'll get through this game. I think we'll actually win it by two goals to one. And bearing that in mind, I'm going to get straight into the 11 I would pick for this game. Um, in goals, yeah, it was quite simple. Ben Leno, um, back four for me in this game. I'll go Bellerin right back, Tierney left back, Socrates and Louise in the middle. Um, going into midfield, the two I'd go for in a pivot is Torreira and Guendozi. One thing on this, I've seen that Emery's been talking about Xhaka and saying that he's ready to come back. Um, he's not ready to come back, you know, it's, it's November, um, coming towards the end of November. We've got one more month in December and then January the 1st, he can go. So um, I've said it before, I've said it again. I don't think he can play for the club again. And, you know, his time's done at the club. And, you know, all the talk about him looking for houses in Milan, he best find himself on the way there come come the January transfer window. Um, nothing against him personally, but based on what he did, he, he's not due a space back in this this side at all. Um, back to the lineup in that ten roll, Meza Ozil. Um, off the left hand side, I'm gonna go over Bamiang. Right hand side, Pepe. Uh, up top, Lacazette. Now it'd be very good to see that front four start. Um, you know, I'm seeing the talks about Kalas, and actually I don't think he's fully fit, so I do expect Tierney to be in there. I'd be surprised if Chambers starts. Nothing against Chambers. Um, he's done well so far this season, but I feel like the time's now for Bellerin to come back into the side. Um, Socrates and Louise, um, I, I doubt any of those two will be dropped for this game. And, you know, I think those three midfields kind of pick themselves up present in Torreira, Guendouzi and Ozil. Um, that's pers my personal opinion. Of course, you can let me know your opinion in the comment section down below. But, yeah, I definitely expect this to be the side that starts. Um, at least, I'm hoping to at least get 9 or 10 out of the 11 correct. But you never know with this manager. Um, so we'll have to wait and see come Saturday. But I'm, I'm confident, kind of. Out of 10, I'm about 6 out of 10 confidence that we'll get the result. But, you know, um, my confidence will be more determined once I see that team sheet come Saturday. But, yeah, that's all from me. Please let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And, of course, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. And I'll catch you next time.